Sex is nothing new for television, but the subject is front and center in the Showtime drama Masters of Sex. It tells the real life story of Masters and Johnson, two groundbreaking researchers who changed the way America understands sex. Now, given that every museum in the world is filled with art, created from this basic impulse, you know, the greatest literature, the most beautiful music. The study of sex is the study of the beginning of all life. And science holds the key. Science. Michael Sheen plays Dr. William Masters. Good morning to you, Good morning. Michael Sheen. Should we call you Dr. Sheen? Yes, please. Uh, <laughs> Dr. Sheen OBE. Because you actually are a doctor. I am. As research for the show, uh -huh. I actually became a doctor. Mainly just to, uh, when I was asked the question, what research did you do? Yes, yes. I, was I became a doctor. But it was an honorary doctorate at the University of Wales. So I won't do any examinations. <laughs> 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 well, that's good, because I've already had my exam. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> but this is the thing about this about the series because I've seen it and you the the way its approach is so clinical because Dr. Masters really felt of sex as science and that is not how most people look at it he really wanted to know how do men and women how do we say this have uh, sex ha have sex and get satisfaction yes and get satisfaction from having sex well, I think it help was me a, out here Michael it was it was um, as alien territory as the moon was because we didn't talk about it because there were no the reports 50s, coming yes. back exactly I, I spoke to quite a few OBGYN surgeons who were at work at the time and they said that when people came in and, and had problems with you know their sexual relationship there was nothing they could refer to yes. other than their own sex life yes so that it was such a taboo controversial there was no platform to be able to discuss those things and it but of course the difference is between masters wants to keep it clinical yes the show itself <laughs> I think shows that you can't compartmentalize it you can't separate sex from emotion psychology that's right vulnerability intimacy that's all right. those issues come up what did he find that was so groundbreaking about sex well, the fact that it was studied at all, the fact that he had people who volunteered to begin with, he had to work with prostitutes because there was nobody who would actually volunteer because um, mm -hmm. obviously it was mm -hmm. fairly controversial work. Mm -hmm. um, and, then, uh, and then most of his study was done in secret within the, the university hospital that he worked at in St. Louis. Um, and so the fact that he was having people have sex in front of him um, uh, and, and being monitored for the first time, he invented all kinds of... This is the area where it gets slightly tricky yeah. because just for me to talk about it and describe it, I don't even know if it's allowed on yeah, I know. this time. <laughs> I know. That's why I'm sort of dancing around yeah. all the words because it still makes so many people uncomfortable to mm -hmm. discuss it. Well, I mean, that's what the subject is. Yeah. You know, it, it, I think any discussion of sex or any depiction of sex and sexuality brings up all the kind of double standards that yeah. we have in our society. You know, yes. you can talk about violence Yes. until the cows come home but as soon as you start talking about sex it all becomes very awkward and difficult you know and in the filming of the series it was a similar thing when I've done movies in the past when you come to a sex scene of some kind it can always be a little bit of a gray area yeah. everyone's slightly uncomfortable about really pinning down what you're gonna do and how it's gonna and happen how you're gonna do it yes. but with this show you know it's scene after scene it's not just one once every now and again so there had to be very clear parameters about how you go about it and you had to be very communicative and talk about it are we what was your con did you have any concerns when they approached you about doing <laughs> this well I suppose uh, my main concerns at the time wasn't about the subject matter because that was what I found very exciting the idea that obviously everyone's interest would be piqued sure. if it was a show about that had sex yes. and sexuality yes. involved in it um, but what I was really interested by and excited by was how um, the approach of it how intelligent and kind of sophisticated the approach was um, and how much it seemed to want to really explore the subject and I'm excited about the character you know you put this man who is so withheld so controlled yes. so yes. you know um, keeping Repressed everything almost. back yeah, yeah. Uh, and you put him in this situation situation where he's trying to keep everything separate and of course it's just gonna be devastation of course uh -huh. it's not gonna happen we're gonna see him unravel which is exciting Congratulations. Con yeah. Continued Thank success to you. Thank, Thank you, you Michael much. Sheen, for coming. Masters of Sex airs Sunday night on Showtime.